And talking batteries, I'm sure everyone here in this room and you know, watching at home is aware about the fire issue. Uh, Tesla's had three fires in its Model S in the last five weeks. Uh, can you talk to the fire protection issue and how it's addressed at GM with your electric vehicles? So I, we've already talked about um, extended range electric vehicles on the road. We have over 50,000 vehicles on the road. We have over 300 million um, electric miles uh, driven. So um, safety and security is very important. Our customers, I, I already talked about how um, we have the most uh, satisfied customers in the industry right now. So, you know, the proposition of um, uh, the safety, the all the other features and functions of the car are, um, I, I think, the right combination and, and making people happy. But um, ultimately, we made no change to the battery cells. We, um, uh, you know, did uh, adjust the, uh, um, put some additional uh, reinforcements. Um, on the outside of the battery, but again, 50,000 cars, 300 million uh, miles later, um, we're pretty happy with the results. All right, so there's been, no, there's been nothing like what Tesla's experiencing, basically. You know, I'm not, I'll, I have no firsthand knowledge of, uh, you know, uh, any of those incidents, but I, I can just speak to our track record, and um, I, think we're, uh, I think we're on the right path. All right, are you planning to give Tesla some um, tips then? I don't, <laughs> so, you know, this, this is what I would say. I think that um, I've talked a lot about adoption, and that's where to get scale, we've got to get adoption. And so I think that um, uh, it's really, the industry needs a lot of great products out there, and we need a lot of customers excited about great products. And, um, you know, I want to keep, uh, you know, people focused on all the good things that, uh, moving to electrified transportation uh, can do for, you know, individual customers and for the country, frankly.